In this video, I'm going to show you how to prepare images to use in the program LaserWeb, which goes with the Emblazer 2. Mainly, we're going to do this in Adobe Illustrator, but if you're doing text, or you're doing a digital image you've prepared, or maybe you're, you're doing it in Paint, but it has to be saved as a JPEG through Paint. When you do it through Adobe Illustrator, it doesn't come out as well with uh, when you go into LaserWeb. So we'll just do some text. I'll just change the size of that. I go File, Save As, and save it as a JPEG. Okay. Now in this program, LaserWeb, I'll just show you an example. So this is a, something I prepared through um, Illustrator and then I saved as a JPEG and Paint. I'll open it and that's worked fine. And I'll do the same thing and I'll open it when I did it straight from Illustrator and saved it. And it says it's okay and sometimes it says it's not with different types of files but that has not worked. There's nothing there. That one there belongs to the one that's come from Paint. So it hasn't worked. Okay, we're going to go into Adobe Illustrator, create new, okay, A4, make sure it's in millimeters, create, a little bit slow to respond here. Right, so I'm going to go File, Open, now we're just going to get these ready so they can be an SVG or a PNG that we can then use happily in uh, LaserWeb. So I'm going to click on it, Object, Image Trace, Make and Expand, Right Mouse Click, Ungroup, click off it, click on, I clicked on a white part, select, same, fill color, then I'm going to go edit and cut. And now I've just got the robot itself. Then I'm going to go file, export, export as a PNG. So it has transparency, export, okay, now we're also going to save that as a SVG, save as SVG, so not compressed but a straight SVG, it's going to say it's called the same, it's just a different uh, file name, save, okay. So that was for something that was imported through um, an image search. I'm going to delete that. And I'll do another object. Open. So this is one that I've uh, drawn. We're going to do the same thing. I'm going to click on it. Same for everything, all of the ones. Anything you're going to use. Make an expand. Right mouse click, ungroup, click off it, click on the white, select, same, fill the color, edit, cut. Now we've just got that by itself. It's got no background. File, export, export as a PNG. Export. Okay, you see there it had transparency. File, save as, change that to an SVG, save. Now we've done a PNG and an SVG so that we've got different options later on in the Emblazer 2. With the SVG, you can do 
just single lines um, as in a cutout, but we'll, we won't be going cutting through, we'll just go as an engraving. Or you can do a, a raster through the PNG where it gives it more thickness to the lines. And I'll click on that and I'll delete it. We're just going to do the text, file, file, open. I'll get my robot text, open. I'll do the same thing with this. So click on it, object, image trace, make and expand, right mouse click, ungroup, click on a white section, select, same, fill color, edit, cut. Now we'll do it, uh, file, export. Export as PNG. Export. You see it's got transparency. Okay. File. Save as. SVG. Save. Okay. That's what you need to do for all of your different images and then you've got the options. But if you really just want to do uh, a laser raster, you really just have to do the PNG one. But it just gives you a few options when you go back into, la into this program, Laser Web, which I'll show you later. Thanks for watching another video by Digital Dovetail. Like and subscribe.